what's happening in this tutorial i'm going to be showing you how to change a color of any object in photoshop cc so i downloaded this image of unsplash and you can see here it's got a cool um, balloon that's tied to this chair and this balloon is pink so what if i wanted to change this balloon and make it a different color because maybe i just don't like pink or maybe it's for a certain birthday party maybe it's for like a boy birthday party or something like that so what i'm going to do is you just drag the image into photoshop and you'll see you have your layer. If you have a lock on it, you can just, you know, click on the lock to turn it off. And what I'm going to do is add an adjustment layer. So I'm going to go down to the bottom side where my layers panel in is. I'm going to click this little menu with the drop down menu and you'll get all these options. I want to select hue and saturation. So with this tool, it allows us to change the colors of certain elements on the page or on an image or anything like that. So what I want to do is I want to click this second drop down menu that says master. I want to select magenta. So whatever this color is closest to, which is, um, it's obviously pink and a magenta is like a pinky purpley color. So that's going to be the closest to the pink. I'm going to click that. Then what you can actually do is you can actually select this eyedropper. And if I select this eyedropper here and then click the pink color, it's going to find sort of that color in the, um, color panel here. I can also add other lighter areas of it. So if I can go around and plus the pinky areas, so the dark area or the light area as well, and it should automatically select it for you. So once that happens, all you have to do is, I'm just gonna drag the box out. All you have to do is drag this hue slider. So as soon as I do that, it's gonna transform the pink to any color I want on this spectrum, which is super awesome. You can see it's crazy, I can do like, change to anything I want. So maybe I want it to be like a blue tealy color. I can also adjust the saturation so I can make it black and white. If I bump this up, I can make it like really um, blue. I wouldn't want to do that unless it's like for a certain style that I'm going for. But you can see I can just bump, bump up the that a bit. Um, and then you got darkness and lightness, but I would probably leave that at zero because um, it just ruins the values of the color. So let me go back. So awesome. And pretty much that's how you do it. If you want to colorize the whole image, all you have to do is click this button, click colorize, and it will change the whole image with the color, as you can see. But if you just want to do the object, don't select colorize, just tick that off, and it will change it. So I can turn this layer off. It's non-destructive, and you can see the balloon is different color, um, which is super awesome. So thanks guys for watching. Hope this tutorial was helpful. Let me know in the comments if you want to see more tutorials like this. And remember to hit that like button and subscribe to my channel for more awesome design content so you can grow as a designer. Thanks so much. See you in the next video.